welcome to my channel. This is exciting. This is my first and this is local. This is Australian. This is actually from my local cross stitch store in um, my hometown, roughly. Um, but I also have a needle minder which I bought for cutting cross stitch. So I'm going to open this one first. It's a little one. This is from For Flux Sake. For Flux Sake. I'm not quite sure where the flux bit came from in her name, um, but it is like the um, flux that you would use for soldering. Anyway, she's Aussie and it is a needle minder that I got for my cunning cross project that is the Marauder's Map. I think so, tissue paper rubbish it says no, I'm solemn I solemnly swear that I am up to no good needle minder first time I've bought from um, oh I can't think of her name Melissa no not Melissa I'm confusing my peoples it's yeah okay hmm it's um, a plastic or laminate kind of um, sticker not sticker um so the writing itself is on a piece of yeah plasticated kind of stuff we've got the hot glue it looks like not a uh, e600 or anything else and we've got two really good magnets um okay there's a little bit of perfection maybe could be done with that but I think it's kind of cool and if I hold it steady you will see um, I solemnly swear that I am up to no good it's a good size needle minder um, possibly could have got away with the bigger magnets um, let me show you on the back the bigger magnets that are um, slightly flatter that would you know the size of a dime kind of thing um, but no, I like that. That's really cool. But that will be going into my um, cross stitch collection. Now, goodies, goodies. There's all sorts in this. This is from Sassy Devils. Now, I'm not sure actually if Sassy Devils ship internationally. I know they ship nationally. And there are all kinds of stitching goodies in here seriously I have no idea so and it's all wrapped okay so Carolyn is the owner of the company or the sassy devil she's no she's actually part of uh, her and two others are part of the sassy devils so this is the birthday box bag okay there's a letter Right, first birthday, golly. Spoiler alert. Oh, okay. There's some tazzy facts. I'll go into those in just a second. This could this is gonna be a slow unboxing. Alright, what do we got? Welcome to Sassy Devils. Thank you for ordering the first birthday sassy pouch. If you're new, welcome. If you're a current subscriber, we thank you for your continued support. As fellow lovers of cross stitch, we hope you enjoy the collection of goodies we've put together for you and would love to hear your feedback. There will be a spoiler alert thread on our Facebook page where you can share your haul when you receive it. We love to see your photos. When you will, you will find in your pouch a little piece of tazzy. This is a piece of puzzle that you will receive in random order in each pouch. Once you have completed the puzzle, please post a photo of the completed puzzle on our Facebook page or Instagram or email if you don't use either of these, and we will send you an extra surprise gift in your next pouch. If you have any queries, please do not hesitate to co contact us. Sassy Devils, Melissa, Carolyn, Joy and Juanita. Now, Carolyn owns a stitch in time in Sandy Bay in Hobart. And... I joined the Sassy Devils Facebook group and then they do these once a month and you can sign up for either a month, three months, I think six months, something like that. And then you get billed monthly, it's like $50 Australian and you get all these toys. So 
Okay. Tazzy facts. Did you know the Dutch navigator Abel Tasman discovered Tasmania in 1642? In 1798, the navigator Matthew Flinders sailed with George Bass in a ship called the Norfolk. They circumnavigated Tasmania, proving that it was an island. Tasmania it was first settled by the British in 1803. Lieutenant John Bowen arrived on a ship called Lady Nelson. She's still down in Hobart. Don't know if it's the same one. Anyway. Lieutenant uh, John Bowen arrived on Lady Nelson with 49 soldiers, settlers and convicts. It's convict settled state. They originally settled in Risdon on the River Derwent, which is just down my... Well, it's actually upriver a little bit. No, it's not. No, uh, no, it's right across. Over there. Where the jail is. Da yeah. <laughs> Where the jail is. It's just across the bridge. From the point of view okay? Of yeah. Uh, however, in 1804, they abandoned that settlement because it's a bit swampy. Um, for a settlement in Sullivan's Cove, the location that would become Hobart. So it's down that way. Hmm? Yeah, they needed deep water. Anyway. We have a natural deep water harbour here. Uh, I'm going to leave the spoiler... I'm going to leave the spoiler closed. Okay. <coughs> yeah. Okay, pass. Right. One. Hmm. One, one. These are heavy. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Um, oh, man. Birthday presents this is crazy okay so we've got nine ten they give you the tea. they make you wait till the chocolate goodness sake that's just cruel okay we we have a piece of jigsaw hold on that one five what is this oh that's two shove over oh you're kidding me i think i'm after just buying one of those <laughs> Six, three, two, ones, and this, oh, four. And I don't know what this is. So let's open the unmarked one. Because this might be a welcome to the sassy pouchy thing. Um, because this is my first. So, celebrate one. And it says, dear Pippa, kind regards, sassy devils. Thank you. Nice little card, homemade. All right. We've got some ribbon with the happy birthday. And, oops. <laughs> Balloons are falling out. Fall. Oh, look at that. Oh, this might be the. I might have paid for a bonus. Thingabajiggy. Oh, I've got bits. Where did they come from? What the heck? Okay, I don't know where they came from. But there's bits. <laughs> falling out everywhere. I don't know. So, this is a sassy pink. It's a 16 count Ada. Color fastness. Not guaranteed. Ooh. Ooh. That's cool. Okay. I think that was a bonus purchase. So we got Ada. <sighs> right. Ones. Let's see what's in here. Okay. If it's got to be cross stitch, no, I have no idea. I have no idea. Could be a scissors. I have ordered. More scissors. Ooh. What the heck? Okay. This is what it is. I haven't seen this before. Oh, good lord. Oh, look at that. It's a fold up scissors. Uh. Do you know? Interesting. They're pretty. Okay, so what was it that, that, and then that? They're cool. They look like spectacles. How cool is that? Now, this feels like the same. I don't know. If I would be meant to get two pairs of scissors. But there's another one. Cool. Maybe I'll give one away. Yeah, I was about to say, I have actually ordered um, some fold-up scissors from AliExpress. We'll see how they go. 
All right. Um, this feels like a pattern. This is two. Okay, happy first birthday, Sassy Pouch. Designed to celebrate Sassy's first birthday in 2020 by Paddock Lane Designs. Uh, model stitched on 28 count, even weave. Calling for CXC DMC threads. And it's a Tassie Devil. How cute. The logo. Whoa! Okay, I'll... That's what you're making. And that's the pattern. And that's really cool. So it's colour printed and shows you the two pages previously. And there's your um, floss uh, with your strands showing how much skeins you would need and all the purple. And that's gorgeous. That's really cute. The Tassie Devil is really, really cute. That's awesome. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's like it's their birthday, but we get to celebrate. Mm. Ooh, it's a project bag. This is a custom made oops, project bag. Stickies. Okay. Uh, what are they? Uh, I think it's, I hope it's been stitched as well. But it's a cloth fabric bag with donuts. So it would be square. It's got the homemade Sassy Devils, Tasmania made, Australia, with the little Sassy Devil tag. It is mm, 28 centimeters square. That's really cool. Um, four. Sassy hand balm with the bally kind of bag. So you've got a little scoop. It's a little spoon. Whoops. Apply 10 to 15 minutes before sewing. If this... Oh, that's gorgeous. It's... um. First instinct is it's a citrus. So what is it? Yeah, it's lemon myrtle. Oh, gorgeous. I'm going to pop that in there or I'm gonna lose it so, um, hang on let me that okay so it's quite firm it's a shea butter let me oh, put it that way all right so you want it absorbed into your skin all right so it's a beeswax shea butter oh that feels gorgeous shea butter is really good avocado oil and scent is essential oil lemon myrtle and when you open it up the immediate the lemon is just beautiful that's that's cool just want to get this to absorb in a bit before I handle maybe other products so you got some <laughs> happy birthday glitters I seriously I don't know where they came from now what is this this feels like a cover minder type of thing needle minder it is a needle minder um oh I might be able to I was thinking about keeping that so we got the sassy devil look there's the sassy devil and there is a needle minder. It's a little cupcake with the skinny magnets. Not hugely strong, but you know, dinky. And it's a cross hip subscription sassy patch. Find us on Facebook at Sassy Devils and then the postal address. Cute. This is some floss. I wonder if this is purple for the birthday. It feels like floss. Ooh, purple. Is that purple etoile? It's got the sparkly stuff in it. So lovely, lovely soft. Or maybe it's like a crinoline. It's a C550, of course, the, the magic purple number. And this feels like a floss too. Hmm. 
Uh, now, if that's purple, ooh, it's variegated. Ooh, ooh, hang on. I've taken the wrong end because this is um, not a country coded. Uh, the, um, I've gone blank on the name. I'll, I know it when I get in there. Or will I? Yes. It's a silk for you. It's 100% silk. It is a sassy pouch. First birthday. 10 meters of probably a custom dye job. So it's purples and pinks variegated. That's gorgeous. And exclusive. Now this is, I think, a 3 inch marker. Which is actually retailing at, I don't know, 15. These are made by Nab's Nest. Sorry, Nays Nest. N-A-E-S Nest dot net. If you're interested, what it does is it marks your borders. So if you need to know where your two inch border is or your two and a half inch or your three inch, there's that. And it's got a sassy devil scorched into it as well. So I have now two of those. So that one and that one will be going into a giveaway later. No idea what's in this. Oh, nifty! It's a floss winder. I don't use bobbins. So, it comes with... They look like cards? I have got plastic bobbins. Um, but these look like they might be cardboard. Yep, cardboard. Um, but it's a bobbin winder. Invaluable if you bobbinate. I don't actually like using the bags. So again, that will also join in a giveaway and maybe even with my bobbins, I'll need to clean them. And then we got chocolate. This is Federation Chocolate. Now Federation Chocolate is a company that was actually owned by friends of mine briefly. Um, they make chocolate locally in, oh, they've had the factories in a number of different places, but it's handmade. Um, by very small businesses like um, when my friends were owned it it was just the her working in the store and he was a real estate agent or something and then they sold the business and they do blocks of chocolates and i didn't realize that they did other chocolates mm. it's orange yum mm. oh my god mm, thank you Oh, that's yummy. That was so good. Oh my goodness. I saw the factory as I was walking past them recently, but I can't think where it was in, for the life of me. I wonder if it, the address is here. I know they're local, and I know they sell in the market, which is a big, big tourist draw here. Um, Victoria Street. Oh! Oh yes, of course, that's where they moved to. They are a city, city centre. Um, but you can buy from them. I don't know if you can buy them online as well. It does have a website, does have a Facebook group. Purchase direct, yes, you can buy them online. All right, so beautiful treat. <laughs> really enjoy that. Um, now, this thing I'm gonna have to keep safe. So I've got a little piece of Tassie jigsaw. So this is my corner of Tassie. So four more to get. And I then get a special gift, which is cool. Um, now, spoiler alert. So let's see what the spoiler alert would have said. Okay, so it says scissors, pattern, project bag, Hand cream, needle minder, DMC a toile one skein, silk for you exclusive colour one skein, corner gauge, floss winder and bobbins, chocolate, little piece of tazzy, home dyed fabric is an optional extra. I took the optional extra. So that's what that pink was at the end, or at the beginning even. Um, so yeah, that was the options. So this is really, really cool. Look, um, as I said, this one I bought for $15. These 
are not cheap from Spotlight. They'd probably be $10, $15. And I know retail and, you know, cost prices and all that kind of jargon. So these are heavy. These are not going to sell for, you know, less than $5. DMC, they're two bucks. That's five bucks. The cover minders normally sell for, you know, five bucks. These would probably be three or four bucks. Um, the hand balm, another, that would probably actually sell for about ten. The project bag is really well made. It's finished, you know, with the double stitching and all of that kind of thing. Um, then you've got the exclusive pattern and then you've got the optional extra. I think you've got your money's worth in this. Um, so if you're interested, I will have the links in the description for the sassy pouch. Um, we have the own brand bags, so you know what you're getting in the mail if you get one of those gorgeous foil purples. And, you know, look out for the Tassie Devil. Thank you. So I hope you enjoyed having a look at that. And... I will confirm that they do ship nationally or internationally because if they ship internationally, hey, you're getting a piece of Tassie here too. Um, I mean, okay, yeah, some things are homemade and some things, you know, are not, but you get a little piece of Tassie. Um, so why not get on board? If you like, you know, little gifts and, and things like that, that, you know, you get to enjoy and pass on. So happy birthday, sassy devils. Um, yeah. Bye for now, see you soon, and I'll see you on the tubes. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your face, and the rain fall soft upon your fields. And until we meet again, may God hold you in the palm of his hand.